brothers and sisters. I hope all is well. So apparently it's the season. <laughs> we get Halloween done and that's it. Christmas stuff everywhere. So we went into the dollar store, my sister and I, and she wanted to get some cards. And she's one of my sisters that loves Christmas. So she buys all the shit. <laughs> I got a couple of sisters like that, actually. I'm very opposite. But anyway, I thought these were the coolest things ever. Look at that. The only thing is, they, they're hard to stay on. So I might have to get a clip or something to go on them. Anyway, let's do our cards. Because even if I put my head down like that even a little bit, they fall off. Falls off. But they're the cutest thing. <laughs> so this is my Christmas. Let's see it. <laughs> Decorate myself. <laughs> anyway, let's get to our cards. Let's see what the cards have to say for us today. We're doing our miracle cards. God's love. Hmm. Rely on the God's love and the spirit love and the love that the universe pours into us. That's what we're here to do, man. Love on ourselves, love on the people, you know. Our greatest opportunity to positively affect another person's life is to accept God's love into our own. And that's including loving yourself. By being the light, we shine the light on everyone and everything. Be that beautiful light that you're meant to be. Don't hold back. Be yourself. <laughs> Just like me. Be myself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> be all day doing that and I was going to get on my nerves. I know it. All right, Super Attractor. What do we have in store today? We got some snow this morning when we woke up. That's it. It's that time of the year. To begin the practice of allowing, I must get out of the way and let spirit give me direction. That is key. We get in our own way all the time because of those filters that we placed upon ourselves because somebody said. Don't listen to the somebody said. Listen to your own spirit. It's uh, crucial in order for you to live a happy life and fulfilled. Don't you want to feel fulfilled? I know I do. Raise your vibrations. <clears throat> Let's give her a go. What do we got today? The universe. Oh, the concert was amazing. Oh, they had a, a, a the head, uh, the people that go on first. So they had these guys, I think they were from Australia. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it's, uh, it was two guys. And, oh, my God, what a beautiful voice this man had. Holy. I'm definitely going to start following them on social media because I just absolutely loved it. You know how you tap your feet? You just give her a go. You know? It was one of those. All right. Let's see what our cards have to say. What do we got? Vibrations. <laughs> Living with purpose brings me prosperity. Absolutely. Figure out what your purpose is and get on it. You know? Sometimes, uh, as humans, we, we walk around this earth <laughs> going, huh, I don't know, huh, I don't know. <laughs> like, seriously, we don't know, really, but you do. You just hit it, and you're not seeing it as much anymore. So, you need to open that up again and create that in your life. Okay, let's see what the book says. I can't even put my head down because these things are... I feel like i got a stiff neck. <laughs> I don't think I can wear these for very long. I'm going to have to get better ones. But I love the lights. That was my favorite part of this. 134. Let's see what the book says. Yeah, they're starting to slip off. <laughs> I was hoping they stay on for the video. Anyway. Have a laugh. Will you have a laugh? <laughs> With this card, the universe is reminding you that your life has meaning. And it absolutely does. By being who you are, you are making a difference. Your trials, tribulations, and learning experiences have all led to you living with purpose. 
doing everything you do with love in your heart. And that's the key right there. Love in your heart. Anything that you do. Don't go around being all hatred and stuff in your own your own self. Because you're only bringing on issues for yourself. Nobody else. Because you feel them the most, right? These other people don't feel your feelings. When you do things with love, the energy around you becomes magnetic to blessings. When you give without needing to receive... When you offer a helping hand, when you take the time to offer yourself approval, instead of seeking validation from others, you attract prosper prosperity. So, you don't need to seek validation from anybody. Why don't you just accept yourself? Accept yourself for who you are. And when you actually do that, oh, you have the freedom of love and the freedom of your light and the freedom to be you prosperity isn't just about material wealth it's about overall wellness a sense of achievement being fulfilled a prosperous person trusts that everything they are doing is creating waves of goodness that will in turn come back to them a prosperous person is kind loving and considerate you are the prosperous person and the your whole life is purposeful. Vibe of the day. Being myself is my purpose. Absolutely. <clears throat> There's nobody else out there like you. You're very unique. Very, very unique as an individual. And uh, hold on to that and just love yourself for that. Don't have to ex wait for anybody's acceptance for anything that you do in your life. Just be good and kind and love. Right? And, and when people think, about wealth and prosperity and all those kinds of words, abundance, you automatically think money and financial. No. No, waking up, being able to eat, being able to walk, you know, not having any ailments. You have a bed, you have a roof, whatever in your life. That's all abundance. That's all wealth. And you need to be grateful for the things that you have in your life right now. Because if you're not, you're not going to get all those other things that you want either. So be grateful for what you have in your life at this very moment. And that's actually living with purpose. You know, and having prosperity in your life. We don't have to be running around and get all the material things. It's just material things. Like I said before, you're not taking that to the grave with you. <laughs> you know, that's why I'm a minimalist. I don't have that much stuff. And I don't want that much stuff. You know what I mean? Just things that I need. I don't need to keep up with whoever. You know what I mean? I like fun things like these, though. <laughs> the cutest. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed the reading. And thank you so much for the likes, shares, and comments. I do appreciate you. You helping your sister with the algorithm. <laughs> That's the key. I need the algorithm to pick it up and throw it out, you know? So I'm trying to manifest that. Well, I am manifesting that because I am getting subscribers. And you guys, I'm so grateful that you're liking my content. Anyways, have yourself a blessed day and we'll talk to you soon. I'm going to go spend some more time with my sister. I think we're going to play some games tonight. I think that'll be fun. <laughs> Anyways, love and light. Talk to you soon. Bye for now. Mwah.